one, go. Zoobots does the mundane yet dangerous task for the zookeepers. It saves both animals and zookeepers' lives. It consists of the tracking bot, the door bot, the cleaning bot, the food bot, and the water bot. The tracker bot monitors and tracks all the zoo bots. It also relays instructions to the robots. If an error arises, it will raise its arms and send a signal to the humans. The, um, the, all the messages will be um, displayed on the operator's monitor. The door bot is a double gate locking system that only allows authorized access to the cage. It prevents animal escaping by only opening one of its two at a time. The cleaning bot cleans the animal cage, um, making sure that the zoo keepers aren't exposed to any parasitic infections or diseases. Cleaning can cause many problems for not only the zoo keepers, but the animals too. Sometimes when cleaning the cage, the, the zoo keeper has to poke the animal with a claw stick that has a pointy edge, and that can really hurt the animal. That is why we have the cleaning bot, to make it easier and so that the zoo, zoo keepers don't have to hurt the animal and the animal doesn't get hurt. That is why we have the cleaning bot. And the food bot delivers food to the hungry animals, ensuring that the hungry animals in turn do not harm the zookeeper. For, um, for example, in the San Francisco Zoo, the uh, a tiger named Tatiana mauled and killed a zookeeper. And zoo, these kind of accidents are actually quite common. Most typically, the accidents happen because the animal is very hungry, it's in feeding time, and it accidentally hurts the uh, zookeeper. For instance, once a zookeeper was feeding the animal out of its hand like this, and the animal accidentally bit off some of the fingers of the zookeeper, which as you can imagine was kind of painful. To ensure this doesn't happen ever, we have made food bots. The water bot delivers and dispenses controlled amount of liquid to the robot, to the animal, especially water. It, it um, especially similar to the um, food bot, it also um, it limits animal-human interaction. And it not only can dispense water, but it can also dispense um, milk to the babies. You know how an elephant doesn't drink the same amount of water as a koala does. That's why the water bot is programmed to dispense um, to dispense actual water similar to the robot, to the animal's diet. What? That's why, and if an error like this happens, the uh -huh. tracker bot will raise its arms, and that's, that did. and um, it can, and it can send it. A signal to the human. That is why that is our Zubot's um, program. What happened there? We hope we hope our Zubots um, our Zubots will help save zookeeper and animal lives. Thank you. The battery died with the, this one.